Greetings, citizens of the digital world. It is I, the Zero Killer, coming to you today on day 220 of the year of vlogging dangerously. And today I'm going to talk a little bit about strange obsession. Now, I'm not talking obsession with uh, something strange. I'm talking an obsession that defies any kind type of uh, uh, sense to me. There are two names in the news recently that you may be well aware of. Two people that you may be aware of, that are involved in absolutely fantastic achievements, but you wouldn't know them because necessarily because of these achievements, but rather because of their hair. That's correct, their hair. The first one is... Uh, it, 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 oh, we're in a style-obsessed society. It, it, it's ridiculous. Um, when these things can become news items. News items! Um... The first person is Gabby Douglas. Gabby Douglas was the winner of the, um, she was a gold medal winner in women's gymnastics at the 2012 Olympics in London. Um, from all uh, accounts, the Flying Squirrel put on a phenomenal performance. I didn't watch, I don't watch, I don't really, I don't really see the, the point. But anyway, she gets a gold medal and the, the focus is not on her achievement, but rather that backlash on her hair being unkempt and, you know, nasty or something like that. I don't bloody well get it. She's a good-looking young woman with a ponytail. She's got a fucking ponytail. How's that unkempt? How's that nasty? I don't get this. Uh, the, the woman just won a bloody gold medal. She is at the peak of a very, and uh, it's, it's a, she's at the peak of a very competitive sport. Uh, uh, she's in incredible shape. She's incredibly accomplished, dedicated. I mean, she's given 10 years of her life, moved away from her family at 14 to bloody well, trained for this stuff. And the focus is on her hair with enough people that it became a news item. The second person whose name you may know, or whose profession at least you know, is NASA technician Bobak Ferdowski. Bobak Ferdowski. Uh, now, Bobak is uh, he's not necessarily known for what he's done recently. He was one of the technicians and the guy who landed, helped land the Mars rover Curiosity the other day. He helped land a Mars rover. That's a pretty bitchin' job. But what's he known for on the internet? He's known for the fact that he has a mohawk with red highlights and he's got yellow stars on the side of his head. What? This is what he's known for? Oh my god. I mean, it's cool that he's become a bit of a celebrity, but this is a strange obsession, people. It's, it's, it's bizarre. I'll post the article, an article with the picture of the hair of him. I'll post an article with the picture of Gabby Douglas, and I'll let you see. But these are two people. One, at the pinnacle of an athletic, uh, uh, athletic accomplishment, which, okay, 10 years dedicated to uh, a, a day of prancing about in a gymnasium isn't exactly something I consider to be worthwhile, because in the zombie apocalypse she's fucked anyway. But uh, someone at the pinnacle of sport, and someone at the someone involved in one of the most amazing things we have accomplished on this planet, and that's exploring other planets, exploring our solar system in a great and wonderful fashion. And, and these two people are known to the internet not for these achievements, but rather for their hairstyles. That, my friends, is a strange obsession. It's beyond fucked up. I, I don't know. I guess I can understand it a bit with the guy because he's got a freaking red mo a red tinged mohawk with actual like dyed stars. It's a little bit uh, out there. Uh, apparently, he's the, the, the he's there are hundreds of memes already about him. My favorite one being, oh, so you played a gig at your local pub le le this weekend. Great! I was landing a Mars rover. See, that's that's the, the hipster douchebag fucking memes are funny, but at the same time, it's strange. Now, if 
that draws attention to NASA in a way that gets young people thinking about space again and wanting to be space rock star technicians. Fuck yeah! But it's strange, nonetheless. And uh, I'm going to leave it on that note. I have, as usual, been the serial killer. Questions, comments, concerns, death threats. You know where to put them? Put them in the comment section below, and I will talk to you all tomorrow.